Hey guys, Riley Spanish here. In this video, I'm going to be opening a bunch of Champion's Path. I picked up all five of these collection boxes today, um, and I got them for a very good price. Now, could I make more money selling these packs individually? Yes, but I would really like an opportunity to pull one of the two Charizard secret rares from the set. Um, so pretty much if I happen to pull one, I will probably stop there and sell the rest of the packs. Um, otherwise, I'll be just ripping all of these packs for fun because it's very rare that I get a chance to open Champion's Path. I got two of the Hatterin V boxes and three of the Dub Wool. There's that promo and the code card, the oversized promo, and four packs. First pack, Gardevoir cover artwork. And every single pack of Champion's Path has a rare hollow or better in it, so it does have you know, pretty decent odds pulls wise, but you know, those Charizards are incredibly difficult to pull. Metal Energy, Beedrill, Machoke, Rotom Bike, Nickit, Kakuna, Ekans, Scraggy, Full Heal, Reverse, Hollow Hatena, and the first pack with an ultra rare, a Waylord V. Second pack here. I feel like last time I opened any Champion's Path, I had six total packs, and I got something like three Ultra Rares out of six packs. So, I don't know if that's normal, but pull rates seem to be pretty high. Just might not necessarily be the cards you're looking for. Grass-type, Kabu, Bead, Turfield Stadium, Ekans, Scraggy, Full Heal, Rockruff, Galarian, Zigzagoon, Reverse Hollow of Swablu, and a Marnie Hollow. Pack number three. I think Besides Charizards, the next most valuable card from the set is the Gardevoir Rainbow Rare, and that's only worth like maybe seven to ten dollars. So not a very valuable set in terms of the cards unless you get those Charizards. That's why it's always tough to want to crack these packs open. Got a Scrafty Rare Reverse Hollow and a Zygarde Hollow. Last pack from this first collection box. The Dredna VMAX cover artwork. I do like that there's, you know, only one version of the code card in this set, because then you don't know if you're getting anything good at the end or not. Water type energy, Turfield Stadium, Pokemon Center Lady, Sharpedo, Rockruff, Potion, Carvana, Roly Coley, Machop, Reverse Hollow Fighting type energy. I do love that you can get Reverse Hollow energies in this, and that is another ultra rare behind it. The same one I already pulled, the Waylord V, but I do really like these Reverse Hollow energy cards. All right, crack the second box open. Here's the code card for the box. And a stack of four more packs. First pack in the second box starts with Psychic Type Energy, Machoke, Malamar, 
Hyper Potion, Galarian Zigzagoon, Carvana, Scraggy, Swablu, Hatena, Reverse Hollow of Pokeball, and the rare is a Scrafty. There's the code. All right, second pack in the second box here. I do see a rainbow rare in the back. I am excited to see what that is. Hoping and praying for the Charizard, but more likely than not, maybe a full hollow train or a, f a full art trainer rainbow rare. We've got Hatena reverse hollow and a Piers rainbow rare. Still a great pull. Not what I was looking for though. Pack number three in this second box here. We've got Lightning Energy, Team Yell Grunt, Malamar, Hatrim, Pokeball, Inke, Vulpix, Potion, Ekans, Bead Reverse Hollow, and Lichen Rock. And the last pack in this second box here. Grass type energy, Sonia, Victini, Absol, Carvana, Roly Coley, Machop, Vulpix, Potion, Roly Coley Reverse, and Professor's Research. All right, so that was box number two. Get this third one open. This one is going to be a double box. Here's a look at the Dub Wool V promo and the code card for the box. Oversized Dub Wool V and four more packs. All right. We've got Lightning Energy, Absol, Rotom Bike, Machoke, Vulpix, Trubbish, Roly Coley, Galarian Zigzagoon, Team Yelgrunt, and another Marnie Hollow. Probably pull the entire set of normal rare hollows doing this doing these 20 packs. There's really not too many cards in this set. I think there's a uh, Altaria and Machamp that I have yet to pull out of it so far. I can't remember what else off the top of my head. Fighting Energy, Hop, Piers, Sonia, Swablu, Vulpix, Trubbish, Roly Coley, Galarian Zigzagoon, another Reverse Hollow Energy, this time a Psychic type, and I do see a full art behind this. Could it be the Secret Rare Shiny Charizard? It's not, it is the Dread Navi full art. Still a good pull, not what I am looking for once again though. I think the shiny Charizard is my favorite card in this set. I'm not a huge fan of rainbow rare cards, but I would still of course love to pull the rainbow Charizard. Psychic Energy, Piers, Malamar, Sharpedo, Inke, Galarian Zigzagoon, Trubbish, Full Heal, Sizzlipede, Reverse Hollow of Nicket, and Scorch Hollow. Last pack in box number three. Darkness Energy, Pokemon Center Lady, Team Yell Grunt, Victini, Rockruff, Weedle, Swablu, Kakuna, Pokeball, Reverse Hollow of Roly Coley, and the rare is a Hatterene. Alright, that was box number three down, on to number four. And you know what?
what? I'm just gonna get the other one open real quick so I don't have to wrestle with the box in between packs. Get these last eight packs done. Hopefully get something good. Here's the last code for a full box. All right, and I've got the final eight packs stacked up there. Gone through 12 so far, have pulled two Pokemon V and one V Full Art and one Rainbow Rare Trainer card. This one has Grass Type Energy, Beedrill, Arbok, Hop, Purloin, Pokeball, Inkay, Galarian Zigzagoon, Trubbish, Reverse Hollow of Sharpedo, and I do see another Rainbow Rare. It is the Gardevoir VMAX Rainbow Rare. A great pull. Of course, I would much rather have the Charizard, but very happy to get that. Seven packs to go, including this one. Got Fighting Type Energy, Beedrill, Hatrim, Milo, Sizzlipede, Galarian Zigzagoon, Scraggy, Rockruff, Vulpix, Reverse Hollow of Fairy Type Energy, and that appears to be a normal V, Lucario V. So another ultra rare, two back to back. Pulled three of those Reverse Hollow Energies as well. Fighting type energy, Arbok, Kabu, Suspicious Food Tin, Purloin, Ekans, Potion, Vulpix, Inke, another fairy type energy reverse, back to back, and Hatterene Hollow. Grass-type energy, Suspicious Food Tin, Malamar, Great Ball, Swablu, Scraggy, Carvana, Galarian Zigzagoon, Kakuna, Roly Coley, another Ultra Rare, Al Creamy V. So that's three packs in a row with V or better. And we are down to the last four packs. So basically one final box remaining. And I accidentally just fanned out the cards there. You can see nothing too special and Obstagoon. I'll actually do the card trick on these last three though. Lightning type energy. Rotom Phone, Turfield Stadium, Bead, Galarian Lanoon, Sizzlipede, Hatena, Nicket, Inke, Rotom Bike, and Machamp. Second to last pack of Champions Path. Fighting type energy, Suspicious Food Tin, Sonia, Lipard, Ekans, Swablu, Inke, Hatena, Kakuna, Reverse Hollow of Victini, and a full art Graplocked V. And this is the last pack here. Would love some last pack magic. Um, you know, in terms of total pulls, really not bad but in terms of you know quality of those pulls have not gotten anything too substantial out of here besides that Gardevoir VMAX rainbow rare psychic type energy Absol, Rotom Bike, Machoke, Galarian Zigzagoon, Weedle, Purloin, Pokeball, 
Inke, Reverse Hollow of Beedrill, and the final rare is a Hatterene. So to go over all of the you know, better pulls, handful of these, Alchemy, Lucario, and two Waylord. And then Graplocked V Full Art, Gardevoir V Max Rainbow, Dredna V Full Art, and Piers Rainbow. Thank you for watching, and please consider subscribing.